And we do have the dark class that does cause damage, whereas opposed to them, they're a bit more ow. Ow! This might be a problem. Alright, welcome back for your dose of... Here in Godhood, as we check out the Will of the People update, there's been a lot of new things added. I haven't really gone too far from the last video because I don't want to skip anything new. And one of the things that I drew really early on after we ended the last video, and I was doing some off-camera grinding, was... I got the study. I don't know what this does, but based on what it's telling me right there, it says gain one miracle experience. So what I'm thinking this does is that without necessarily having to send your people out to fight, they get experience to get miracles, just based on that little small description alone. You know, I'm a smart guy, what can I say? You know, things come to me fairly easy in life. Oh, nothing gets by you. But um, I guess we'll build this right now because we have enough materials to do it, so why not? Um, study. Now the question is going to be, where do we put this study area? Because over here is working area. Here we have, like, um, relaxation for HP. We do some worshipping right here, and here we gather resources for offerings. So I don't think anything too far from the, the garden would be too bad. Because, you know, you're studying, you know, still fairly relaxing, so I'm going to place that right over there. And let's give this a try. Let's see if I could get... I was about to call this guy a Darian. Excuse me? Masa, what are you doing here without the without the green skin, my man? You know the routine. You join, you get the green skin. Um, let's send a Darren. I, was, I, I keep thinking Adrian when I see this guy. Let's send you off to do a little bit of that, and let me verify if I'm correct here. So, currently you're at 50. So this is a positive thing, you should get an increase to that, right? So we have people gathering experience. Oli, who I feel like calling oil all the time, <laughs> is getting his HP back and you're gathering some resources for us. All right, so right now things are fine. Let's go ahead and skip forward. One of the things I've noticed here is that there is less, like, you know, it's more, there's more thought process involved now. And I'll explain what I mean here pretty soon. Yep, it went up. So, giggity, it, giggity. It. It went up, so it went up by 13%. So one experience is 1%, huh? Alright, so we have a next class coming up. Let's go outside then, and maybe by... Maybe by fighting we could get Adarian a little bit happier here. So... Let's have Ali grab some more... Materials. Let's step outside. And... Who do we beat up? Let's see, we got the light group over here. They will give you seven ritual offerings over here. No tribute. What's the reward here then? Oh, it, it matches only, um, green skins, which we don't have at the moment, any light up, I see. There are druids in there, and they are very strong against divine, luckily we have no divine people, so you know what? I think that our dark dudes would do a good number on them. I know you're upset, Adarian, alright? Maybe after getting some blood on your body, you'll be a happier boy, that's all I could really hope for here. Luckily for you guys, or at least unluckily for you guys, I hit physically, so... It's all good. I would have preferred to knock it in the first round so it don't take any damage. The other thing I've noticed too is that... Before, you know, if you win a fight, unless your boys get really, really hurt, it wasn't a problem because you could just go into the next fight immediately. Now, any small little bit of damage that you take carries over to the next fight. So you have to take time to put them in the garden and recover that HP. They do recover without being in the garden. A little teeny tiny bit is what I've noticed, but just really not enough to be sizable. So. It's, it's a lot more strategic now, is what I could say. So ecstatic happy, yeah, so fighting made him a happy boy. He was just upset because he wanted to get blood in his body. Un understandable, considering we are the orcs after all. So let's see here, we're at 6249, class is ready to come in. Let's do Inspire Miracle. Mazda is happy. Ali is neutral, I want to get those wondrous ones. We have enough to get both of them in there. But I would prefer it if you guys were happy before I tossed you in there. I don't think there's anything here. I don't think the... This... Enthusiasm effects... I don't think this makes people happy anymore like it used to. Look, let's just use the Inspire Miracle on Maza. And obviously... For you, it's cunning and might. So, for now, let's just do some might work for you. And then... Let's cancel you. What are you collecting for me at the moment? That is materials... We know there's one waiting around for green skins. L let's try it out. I'm pretty sure it doesn't make you guys happy anymore, but we need green skins for one of the fights coming up. So you do that. If it makes you happy, then we'll know. Awesome. We got the Wonders Farm Miracle as well. Good job, Masa. So that should be a little bit of an extra boost right there for us. Two to might. Nothing really too crazy just yet, but it's fine. Devotion, a little bit of HP. And we got Agile Claw, which will replace one of our regular claws. Good. Blessed be, Masa. 
And Ali is down. These guys are so bloodlusty, you know? They, they can't be here just gathering supplies for the crops and everything and for the civilization. No, we gotta be out there constantly getting the blood in our bodies. I mean, I know they're orcs and everything, but still, we gotta build here home as well. Now, I can't give you that miracle now because you're upset. You probably will draw, like, the minor one, which is no good, so now we gotta get you to fight. And what do we got here? We've opened up a little bit more. We got a first doubler fight over there as well. We got a four over here. What do you guys do? You tribe... You match offerings by 50%. I guess we could probably do that one. This one does 50 as well. And there's also a common relic there, which could be fairly useful. I guess we could have Papan probably take care of that, because Papan's currently ecstatic. And then over here, you match green skins, huh? Hmm. Oh, dark boys, which means... Ooh, we... I mean, it would kind of be like just a battle of wits, but let's do it. I wanted to use Maza, but whatever. Maza would kind of get rocked here. Plus, they're also recovering HP, right? So they would come in here, not only with the chance of being rocked, but also with half HP. Yeah, that's kind of like a recipe for disaster. For now, at least for the most part, it's like a wash when you have like dark against dark. And we do have the dark class that does cause damage, whereas opposed to them, they're a bit more... Ow. Ow! It's gonna be a problem. Thank you. Oh, please, just do two. Oh, okay. Alright. The problem with Ollie was Rage Prophet. No defenses, as a matter of fact, negative defenses until the very last miracle where you actually have a chance to make it that they have like zero defense. But right now they're in the negative, so yeah. They saw a big glaring hole right there in that arm and they're like, we're gonna go after it. Alright, so we got our rewards right there. Let's continue onwards. Uh, let's see. Look at that. They're all happy and ecstatic now. It's just really a matter of getting blood on their body. That's the orcs never. Oh, no. No! No! Papan grew gray. Oh, Papan. It's coming. Excuse me? Did they literally turn your hair gray because you went gray? Was that a feature before? Or was your hair already this color? For some reason, I thought Papan was like blonde or something. Yep. Alright, so we have enough for at least one miracle now, and he's happy. So let's go ahead and get a Darian. Adrian is um miracle here. What are you working on? That's the Holy Sight Center, right? Yeah. So let's cancel out of that. Let's give you Miracle off to the farm. That's going to take us two days, but so be it. We can only put one person in there at a time, right? E oh, we could get this upgrade right now for a plus two to might. That <sighs> Okay. Yeah, hold off on building for a while, but it's a matter of just getting our miracles as, you know, top-notch as possible, especially if we get some wondrous ones. If we get wondrous ones, they're like a plus three to plus four, yada, 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 which is very good. Okay, now, you are gathering more resources. You know what, for that, we're gonna probably have to stop. <laughs> and let's kind of go build heavy if we can. You're recovering your HP, correct? That is what those palm trees are about. Yeah, you're in the garden, get your HP back. Ollie, you know what, I'm gonna give you the same treatment as well. Although, I think I'm gonna put one person there at a time, right? Yeah. It's a big-ass garden. Well, you can't tell me two of you guys can't be there at the same time. Oh, no, we must take turns. I'm worried about Papan, but Papan's stats are fairly good enough right now that we can still rock him for a bit longer, even... Oh, dog! Oh, Wondrous One would have been so good right now. Especially after I invested the plus one into Might. So you could have had, like, a plus four or five easily with some HP and devotion or something. You know what you've done to me? You've done me terrible! Nod, Adrian. Cunning or Might. Let's see. I mean, you definitely do with a bit more gunning on you. I ain't gonna lie about that. But, um, let's just go ahead and have you hit super, super hard instead. Two more materials, skip next, the next one will go out and fight. Don't get upset, you, you stinking orcs. The people are getting upset, though. They're impatient. Everybody wants blood in this area. All right, well, let's go. Let's go step outside. Um, out we go. And who do we beat up? Good question. Here we go. This one we can do. And they also apparently have a common relic. Oh, this one will give you materials too. Either or. Either or. You just pick your one. This one... More doable. Yes. Because then we could use, um, Ollie over here for you. And then... As long as we're gonna put Maza out there, Papan and Adari and Shu do the rest for us. Okay. Yeah, the other one kind of has, like, a fairly good little circle that kind of counteracts what we're going for. And... This new Will of the People update is kind of like maybe a bit more hesitant. Before, I feel like there was like no stopping me. Because if you lost, you just lost. All you have to do is wait around to get your people unbroken or get their HP back and you go back out and do it again. Now, if you lose, you lose those tributes and you gotta now 
take longer to build them back up, to go back out, to win a fight, to get the tributes into your inventory. You see what I'm saying? So like now there's an incentive for losing. Before, you lost, no big deal. Now there is a, a waiting game involved. If you lose, all those materials you drew up, they go bye-bye. So yeah, <laughs> now it's like, oh, yeah, let's, uh, let's think about this really well. 5 and 45. So at least we got building materials now to build whatever we wanted to, which was, I think, the cunning one, right? So I guess we could probably do that? Yes, we can. So, do it now, you're saying? Do it now? Let's do it now. Remove from our civilization, right? So, like, they go out to hunt. Animals would not ideally be here, where, where the humans are at. They'd be off over there, right? There's a couple of fights out there that do give greenskins in return, so if we build a couple of them up right now, we could have a pretty nice little haul as long as we win. Is the thing. I might even want to consider getting Maza off of this one. And putting Maza in the holy site as well. Ollie went into new Oh, see, that's really annoying now that I think about it. If they're doing the miracle and they he was happy when we put him in there, but he's gotta wait two turns, so within the two turns he dropped to neutral. So my chance for a wondrous one just dropped alongside of that too, I have to imagine. Maza's down now, of course. Far miracle? I mean, it makes sense when you think about it. Like, if you're working on something, you know, when you're working on something in real life, you get a little bit, you know, down and out, you don't want to do it or something or whatever. So it does kind of make sense. It, it's realistic. <laughs> but for a video game standpoint, I don't want that part to be realistic. I want it to favor my needs. We got Blind Strike. Deals random, random heavy ancestral physical damage when targeting a random opponent. All right. And now you're down. Let's go out and fight then. Well, luckily we have a couple of fights that give us green skins in return and we have 14 built up, so... Let's get Ali Masa some blood in their bodies that they're excited. You guys are getting a little... They're actually excited right now, too. Good. Step outside. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We need uh, one more thing to... Actually, two. To put down, so... Adarian. Start grabbing materials again. And since you're neutral, grab materials for me. Let's go outside. Alright. Where's the green skin party at? There we go. This will give us seven. This is a fairly easy fight. We have Divine, Yorok, Ollie, but everywhere else we are kind of fine. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta get in a fight so that their mood elevates a bit as well. Hmm. Alright. I was hoping for the first round now because I'm gonna have to like wait around and take needless damage. Eh, it's not too bad. I don't think I'll put up, maybe Maza, yes, but at least Adarian's not gonna go into the garden for two days just to clear up that HP. He still's got a little bit more left in there. Maza, he is a lot more squishier, so him, yeah, I guess we'll probably have to put him in the garden for a while. But, we got green skin, so it's fine. 18 away from another level up, too. Oh, we... Never mind, I guess we just got it now. Don't mind if I do. We have our first statue as well, and we went up to 25. All right. Maybe now, maybe now I'm a bit more considerate about bringing that class, is what I'm thinking. I want to hopefully get Masa and Ollie into this fight so that our neutral goes up to a... happy. So, you are... right, this is the one that we skipped out on earlier. Mm-hmm. Papan would probably be the safest bet here against them, but Pawn's gray on the way out. Adarian still has a bit more oomph in their body left over. This new meta that they've introduced is just so weird. I gotta go Adarian here. This is like a complete roll in the dark here. I feel... There's a chance we could lose this, and if we lose it, I'm gonna be really upset with myself. Because I brought it upon myself. Don't st stop using the wall, I know what that does. <laughs> I learned full well with my divinity run how useful you guys can be. Against classes, or at least like, builds like ours. Retribute, okay. Eh, don't like it, but whatever. No! Stop it! Stop minimizing my damage, you scums! We did half of their HP. Now, they're not going to hurt me too much. I mean, wow, that's, that's a surprising amount of damage they did for a freaking bash. I'm surprised they're going after Ollie as opposed to, like, Maza. But luckily, by hitting Ollie, it did raise my attack power, and... Thank God, alright. So Ollie's going to get a little bit of rest time, but at least we got it through. And this should hopefully get them all into a static... At least, I mean, maybe happy, but I'm hoping a static at the very least here. And we got our common relic, 1036. All right, who's going to work on this one? Well, oh, only the people who take part in the fight get to bless the relic. Before it was anybody in your entire disciple list. Intriguing. Well, they're all ecstatic at the upside here, so let's get... 
Let's get Ali to bless this one here for us. Everybody's ecstatic in the party. Perfect. What the hell is this? Initiation Flint. Upgrade Ritual. Upgrades Ritual with two to five? Oh, okay, so I equipped this on a person working on a location. For instance, the guild build or gathering materials. And they will get a two to five extra if it's equipped on their body. Because this is something that you equip on somebody, obviously. So, for instance, uh, a Darian is working the building materials. So if I give this to a Darian now, two to five is what you're requiring. All right, you know what? Let's um, let's bring in the class now. Papan, I love you, Papan. But man, 47, a Darian in a way almost has kind of really taken over what a Papan started for us. So, a Darian is the one that we're going with forward. So I think it's time for us to say goodbye to Papan. Thankfully. At the very least, man, had we gotten you, like, maybe a third miracle, you probably would have given us more rewards for sending you off. But now, especially how things are playing out, it feels like sending people out is also kind of, like, more important than ever. Because I, I imagine that by sending them off, you still get a bunch of rewards back, right? So here's gonna be Morali, the last person from the Papan bloodline. Hopefully, oh my god, a triple all around. Thank you, Papan. That's all we can fit in, unfortunately. So you guys still no go. You guys are in your 30s, gonna have to hang out a bit longer. But now we have Morali over here. Morali, what's gonna be your thing? I should have probably checked before I brought you in what your favorite classes were, but I did not. I was too excited about the idea that you are indeed a three all around. So I'm gonna wrap it up here for this one, guys. I'm gonna get Morali a class and get us ready for that. And hopefully we have an easier time going forward. This is it's different, you know? I like the changes, but I'm still in the mind frame of how the game used to be before. This is a completely new meta. It changes everything up. And I've noticed too that they're building roads on the way there. You see that? There's actual walking roads being done by the the the, the commute that they actually have to take to these locations. It's kind of cool. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Look out for the next episode. I will catch you next time.